all that I've experienced with my hearing loss and my son's deafness has ignited within me a profound, passionate desire to delve deeply into all aspects of our hearing and communication. Throughout this journey towards self-acceptance, as I sought out individuals with whom I could connect and pursued advocacy and representation, I went through many emotional stages, such as denial, sadness, hope, courage, anger, strength, and love. Interacting with others within the realm of hearing differences has shed light on my own limiting beliefs and fears, ultimately allowing me to trust my path and release the need to control my expectations. What initially began as a form of therapy, a means to process the myriad emotions I had bottled up inside, evolved into something far greater than myself. While connecting with adults and children who are deaf and hard of hearing, I began to incorporate their stories into my mixed media art world, a collection I've named My Lucky Years. I've endeavored to represent every facet of the hearing experience through various mediums. Choosing to live in a state of wonder, remaining present as much as possible, and translating my newfound insights into my art became my focus. My aim is to inspire, shatter taboos, educate and serve others to the best of my ability. I also seek to explore our relationship with our hearing and communication, honoring our individual essence. My Lucky Years pays tribute to the journey and experiences of those with hearing differences, and I cherish every moment of it, every aspect of it. These are My Lucky Years. <laughs>